Chris to me means life. It's all about nurturing and just prospering. First thing that comes to my mind is um, the flower from the book, The Little Prince, and how the flower is like, it's starting to grow and then it waits for like the perfect time when the sun is rising to just open up and it's just so beautiful. That That's kind of like flourish to me. You have to thrive and grow and do wonderful things. It's not about having more faith because Jesus said if you have faith of a mustard seed you can move mountains. It's really about maturing your faith. And flourish is about maturity. Flourish is about generational thinking. Flourish is about having roots and being planted and being part of a garden, being part of a community. It's really about being who God has called us to be and that He created work in advance for us to do. And it, our lives are about saying, Lord, what is that work? And let us flourish in the giftings and the talents and the calling that you have for us. Flourishing shalom has to do with having peace with God with each other and, and with our world. Communities get along. People are important. Everyone's important and necessary. And we begin to actually look like what God intended. I think flourishing is an opportunity to live according to God's will for your life that you're able to then carry out His will to benefit someone else. Flourishing is for everybody, not just those who are wealthy and have great jobs and are upwardly mobile. We have to flourish together.